Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. Um, this is only going to be a short one. I know I haven't been posting for a little while, but that's what's happened. Um, yeah, so I've had been having issues with the Euro. Um, basically what's happening is the power's been cutting out. So, yeah, what happens is when I'm driving, the, the radio actually turns off and also my dash turns off, all the, all the dials kind of just go down to zero and then basically it only lasts for like half a second and then it comes back up and the radio comes back up. So it happens every now and then, but um, yeah, I don't know, some days, some long trips, I drive maybe like, I don't know, 20 kilometers in the morning, 25 kilometers in the morning, um, and which takes, I don't know, somewhere between half an hour to an hour and some days are fine like doesn't do anything but then other days it's like ridiculous like on the way back today was like every time um happened maybe like 10 times that it cut out and um but the engine's fine like accelerating everything's fine it's just when you actually yeah when uh, i don't know feels like maybe when the aircon kicks in and sometimes it kicks in it it reduces power so yeah i don't know it's a bit weird but so one thing that they were saying was um the clean the battery terminal so i i took off all the battery terminals and i cleaned it with microfiber and that didn't well it did something for maybe a couple of days and it was okay but no nah, it's still having issues then i read a couple of things um online the last few days and they said oh there might be something wrong with the negative and there's people that have said things about it so yeah so that's what i'm gonna do yeah so this negative cable here i won't touch that but there's this negative cable that goes to the battery um that hooks into this hole here um i've just actually just taken it out um it looks a, it looks okay but yeah, it could be better. So yeah, so I went to a super cheap today and I bought one of these guys. I bought one of these, uh, brand new. It's quite thick. Um, it cost me 20, 22 bucks. I got the actual longer one. There was one shorter one which was 20 bucks which would have made it which would have been the same size as that car but yeah decided to give this one a go it's a little bit longer so should be all right so i can probably use the same hole um and connect that in cool just gonna screw this in Ooh. make sure that doesn't touch that Try this guy out. Okay, so it got pretty dark pretty quick, but it's finished. Okay, so I just fit that and it runs down there a little bit. It's on the it's on the bracket, but that's okay. And that's nice and tight. Cool. Start at first go. Yes. Cool, so thanks for watching. Uh, that was a little quick one, but um, yeah, hope you enjoy that and see if it works. Hey guys, just just letting you know, it's been a week and a couple days, and um, I haven't had any issues with my Accord Euro with that battery cable swap. So that's awesome. So um, yeah, I recommend doing it. Um, I might give it another go and have a look at it. Um, and give you guys an update in a, in a couple of weeks or in another month. But um, so far, so good. Awesome. Hopefully this helps you. Uh, remember to subscribe and do all that fun stuff. Cool, thanks. Mm -hmm.